the reason your mortgage pre-approval is so important is this right here. So recently I had an agent reach out to me about a property that we have on the market. He has a buyer who's interested and wanted to make an offer and I said, great, just send over the offer and the pre-approval and I'll present it to the seller. Not a problem, easy peasy. Hours go by, never got the offer. The next day the buyer agent reached out to me in the morning and said, uh, it's gonna be a little while maybe 48 hours because the buyer is getting their pre-approval done with their lender. Okay, so one, why you're looking at properties without the pre-approval doesn't make sense, but what's not, that's a story for another video. So here's the deal. While that buyer was getting their pre-approval in order, that was taking 48 hours apparently to get through desktop underwriting, another offer came in on the property and the seller accepted it. So if you're out looking for property and you don't have a pre-approval, first of all, I would not recommend that. Your agent shouldn't recommend that because you could find the house that you want and by the time you get your pre-approval done, somebody else could buy the house. Also, you need to know what kind of financing you're gonna have. Do you qualify for FHA? Do you qualify for conventional? Are you using your VA benefits? What does your program look like? Do you have enough down payment money? Do you need the seller to help you with down payment money? All of that could be in your pre-approval. And all of that is information that you don't have and that your agent doesn't have until you speak to a mortgage lender and get the pre-approval. So that's it guys, get pre-approved before you go out looking at houses, otherwise you could be wasting your time and everyone else involved. Have a good one.